this beautiful spring day, the ponies are happy to go out to pasture where they can nibble the tender grass and do exactly as they please. Mr. Peel raises only the finest ponies and sells them to people who want to raise quality stock. Taffy was born last night and feels timid in the strange world. She is shaky on her long, wobbly legs. Little ponies are called foals as long as they nurse. Dolly is black and her mother is brown. The foals may take their color from either parent. The colt firefly is the pet of the farm, and Mr. Peel has high hopes for him. He is built just right, from the tip of his nose to his stubby tail, and may be a champion someday. The little foals are inquisitive. What is lightning doing? Hey, looks like fun. And soon Firefly is rolling just like the yearling pony. Rolling cleans his coat and makes it shine. <laughs> now Firefly, better not chew the wire fence. Firefly and Dolly like to be together. The foals soon find other ponies they enjoy being with and one finds the same playmates together day after day. They like to watch the horses in the pasture across the road. <laughs> there is nothing better for growing colts than to romp and race and fight playfully with each other. At times, they really hurt one another with their flying hoofs. However, colts that are kept alone may grow up to be shy horses. Firefly is a cocky little horse with lots of spirit and courage. He likes to clown and may end up with a circus. When Firefly is a year old, he will be called a yearling, although he will often be referred to as a colt until he is five years old. A female pony like Dolly is called a filly until she is about three years old or until she has her own foal. Then she is called a mare. Firefly is tired out and wants to rest. Ponies, like babies, sleep and eat often. It looks as if he would like to say, Dolly, please go away and leave me alone. I can hardly keep awake. Each little pony is different and has a personality all his own. Finally, Dolly does go away, and how glad little Firefly is to go to sleep. While the ponies are resting, let's return to the barn and see how Ernie cares for the stallions or father horses. Whitecrest takes many prizes at the pony fairs and is worth several thousand dollars. Therefore, his colts are valuable. He is so little that Ernie can reach over him and groom both sides of the pony from one position. A vigorous grooming keeps the coat healthy and shiny. As Ernie grooms the pony, he looks over him carefully to be sure he has no cuts. Ernie is also training Black Beauty for the show ring. He teaches him to run fast and to lift his feet high. The stallion must learn to stop quickly and to pose correctly. Black Beauty has the points of a champion, a fine, intelligent head with large, clear eyes and alert ears, a well-set arched neck, sloping shoulders and a deep body. He has strong, straight legs and well-developed hindquarters. Ernie handles the ponies gently and teaches them good manners. In other countries, a stocky work pony is used on farms and in mines. Sometimes, Ernie exercises black beauty in the ring. How beautifully he holds his head as he prances around. Since early times, men have admired a beautiful, spirited horse. 
Horsemen like a stallion to have pride, strength, and courage. Good breeding makes not only beauty and speed, but also character and endurance. <laughs> In the noonday heat, the pretty white geese drink and try to bathe in the small pan of water. It is time for the ponies to drink too, and so Ben moves them to a pasture with water. These ponies are raised for riding. Most of our fine horsemen learned to ride on ponies when they were children. They run quickly to the troughs of cool, clean water. Taffy is learning fast for a foal who is only a few hours old. Now, now, mustn't put your feet in. On this farm, the ponies grow strong because they receive good care, proper food, water, plenty of exercise, and they sleep on a clean bed of straw in a well-aired barn. Even their hoofs are cared for, and their horseshoes are inspected often. What are Firefly and Dolly looking at through the fence? The beautiful roses? The chickens, who are looking around for a little extra food? Or perhaps Tabby, the cat? Sometimes everything is quiet and peaceful in the pasture. Firefly and Dolly like to nudge each other. This is one of the ways the ponies show they are fond of each other. Queenie seems nervous. She's afraid that lightning may hurt her tiny foal. Lightning was Queenie's colt a year ago, but now that Queenie has a new foal, she teaches lightning to be independent. She trusts the brown mare and doesn't mind at all when she stays near Taffy. Horses graze all day as they eat slowly and often. At first, the timid little foal stays close to her mother. Her legs are steadier now. Shetland ponies are intelligent little animals and at times even open the pasture gates. Lightning waves her mane in a wild fashion and teases Queenie. The mare chases the yearling away and quickly returns to Taffy. Sometimes other mares in the pasture are jealous and might harm the baby colt. Stay away, Lightning. Queenie keeps her eye on all the ponies. Romping and playing make up much of a colt's early life. They race around the pasture and the mares join in. The love of speed shows early because the horse has always protected himself by running from danger. When he is cornered, he puts up a good fight, kicking and biting. Lightning will be a strong, fast stallion. Firefly is a real show-off, always performing for the other horses. He has the points of a fine pony and should grow up to be a champion stallion. The dog plays often with the ponies. They have become good companions and have fun together. Queenie takes Taffy to the far end of the pasture. It is as natural for a foal to run as it is for a bird to fly. It is evening, time to take the ponies to the barn, where they will have their grain and a clean bed of straw. But Queenie doesn't want to come. Even the baby pony weighs a lot for Ernie to lift. 
Queenie will stay near Taffy and guard her all through the night. The ponies on this farm are sturdy and happy because they are well cared for and are treated with kindness. The little ponies are tired and hungry for their good dinner that is waiting for them. Now, Taffy, you must come too. Just think, now you are a whole day old.